time for another update about our photosynthetic bacteria plant food that we've been making from scratch and these are the same four bottles that I showed you about a month ago when I started this experiment and as you can see there's quite a difference in the color in each of these bottles this bottle here that the PSB is looking quite green was one that we filled with water from our house from inside the house so this water comes from a bore just down the back there this bottle here is one that I filled with water from the pond and then these two bottles here are ones that I filled from the canal at the back. This bottle was filled with water from the canal and contained no sediment and this one here that's quite a bit darker and a bit browner is water that was filled from the same canal but that contained a reasonable amount of sediment from the bottom of the canal. And this is quite interesting to see the slight difference in these two. The bottle with the sediment actually changed colour a lot more quickly than this other one that didn't contain the sediment. And then these other two are just a bit of a mystery to me. My wife did suggest that I may have put too much of the concentrate, the original mixture of MSG, fish sauce and egg that I mixed up and left sitting for a week and then added to the bottle. The recipe calls for just one tablespoon per five litres, but I had a little bit extra, so I think I ended up putting in between two and two and a half tablespoons into each bottle. Now this one here, the which is the water from the canal, it didn't contain the sediment. This actually looks as good as it's going to. This one here with the, the water from the canal that contained the sediment, I'll mix it up a little bit, is... Yeah, it's quite a bit darker and uh, as I said it, it, it changed colour quite a lot more quickly than the others and then these two here um, I'm just not sure what's happening with those so what I'm going to do is I will empty these bottles and clean them and I will do the experiment again. You know, I tend to do things a bit more creatively maybe a bit more artistically than scientifically and I'm experimenting. I'm not an expert, I'm an experimenter. And making these videos, I'm just doing it to encourage you to show you what we're doing and to hopefully encourage you to try it yourself and see what you can get. And it's been an interesting experiment. As I said, we've got four quite different results from the different types of water, but I'm really keen. I'm, I have no idea. I'm not a scientist. I don't know. I've got no way of testing each bottle to know why each one is a different colour or anything like that but I'll just try again and experiment again uh, take some more photos make some more video and see if we can come up with similar or different results I'm not sure the big difference is now in the water that I'll get I'll take it from the same water sources but the canal that's at the back when I took this water from it was nearly dry and it did actually stop for a couple of weeks at least two or three weeks there was no water in that canal but the rains have come the monsoon started here in Thailand and that canal is running quite deep and quite swiftly so I'm not sure if I'll be able to get much of a sediment from it uh, but I'll certainly be able to fill one of the bottles at least with water from that canal and then sure, the water from the house that's turned green in this bottle, I'll use water from exactly the same source, but I'll just put one tablespoon of the mixture in it. And then the same with this from the pond. I'll take the water from the same pond to try and keep it consistent, but now that water, of course, because it's started to rain here, will be somewhat different. So it'll be another experiment to see what we can come up with and just to be able to show it and share it and, like I said, to encourage you all to try making this photosynthetic bacteria plant food because once you've got it like I've got one bottle that I know for sure is successful and we will be able to use this in the garden but we will also be able to use it as a starter for other bottles of this plant food that we'll continue to make. So please be encouraged and if you are experimenting with this if you're trying this yourself please let us know in the comments. I am always open to constructive criticism and helpful comments so please let me know if you've got any ideas about how we can make this more consistently the right color i hope this has been helpful to you if you've enjoyed it please click that like button and if you're not yet subscribed to the channel please do so and if you want to check out the other 
videos that we've made in this series about photosynthetic bacteria plant food, please check out this playlist here and you'll get to see all of the videos. Hey Pepe, how are you doing? Are you going to help me with this? Are you? Are you just going to come and have a look? What's going on? Nice to see you. Just come for a cuddle. Just come to say hello.